and welcome to GFL Missionary News Update. I'm Ron DeWorld. Today's special report comes from Singapore, an island located here in Southeast Asia. At three and a half times the size of Washington, D.C., and a population of over five million, it is a mecca for much of the industrial, economic, and education to many in the Asian region. The continent of Asia holds approximately 60% of the world's 6.5 billion people, making it a right field for evangelism and harvesting for God's kingdom, where people coming to Christ is not measured in tens or hundreds, but by thousands. One such group that is poised and ready to continue its impact is the East Asia School of Theology, also known as EAST. This school was established by Campus Crusade in 1992 to develop and equip Christian leaders to be passionate spiritual multipliers through sound doctrine and preaching. They offer bachelor's and master's degrees in biblical topics to over 120 diverse students each year. Many of our viewers may recall a special visit from Chris and Faith Creech as they shared their hearts for evangelism to the lost. At that time, they were preparing to have God open the doors and serve in Asia using Chris's background as a pastor, teacher, church planter, as well as his advanced degrees. That door has opened and he will become a professor at East Asia School of Theology in the next few months. So far, the Creeches have raised an unbelievable 90% of the funding to be a teacher at East, needing only 10% more. Let us now go to our on-the-spot reporter, Ivana Travell. Ivana, why are the Creeches uniquely qualified to be part of the teaching staff oh. at East? Excellent question, Ron. Chris was excited to learn that East had a particular need for someone who could teach Bible interpretation and cross-cultural preaching. These happened to be the two specific areas which Chris had specialized in during his PhD studies. Combining this with Chris and Faith's personal connection to Singapore through past friends from the country, it became clear that they should be teaching at East. Chris believes that Bible interpretation training is of special importance as it will help clarify Christianity as opposed to the mix and match theology which is becoming prevalent throughout Asia. I don't know about you, Ron, but follower of Christ sounds much better than evangelical Buddhist Catholic Taoist. I would agree, Ivana. From what I understand, Grace Fellowship is an exceptional church in its continued support of its list of missionaries, to which the creatures were added to this last year. How is this additional support different from what GFL as a church already provides? Well, Ron, as part of an individual's hive, the church contributes a portion to the support of missionaries like the Creeches and Gadarians. This is a request for those in Grace Fellowship to contribute above and beyond their tithe to help the Creeches with the last 10% of their support funds and send them to Singapore. I'm Ivana Travell. Back to you in the studio, Ron. Thank you, Ivana, for that special report. If you would like more information, please contact us here at the station or any member of the GFL Missions Board. Also, please pray for the creatures, and if God moves you to support their ministry, please do so. This wraps up today's edition of GFL Missionary News. I'm Ron DeWorld. Good day.